What up, though? It's your girl, Jay. I'm here with the one and only Maya. Hi. Okay. If y'all don't know who she is, Google her, baby. Google Oh, I am google exactly. Myers Carlethia. I am google -a The fuck? <laughs> so here, we're here on the juice box for another episode of Redefining Language. And I'm here with Myers, and she's going to pick her word. So with eight different um, letters in language, you my whole bitch nigga. Um, can I do two? I'm gonna do two words. She's special. So the words nigga, bitch, savage, motherfucker, fuck, shit, ho, gangsta. Which one you want? Okay, so I definitely want ho because like in a, in the real world, I was a ho ho one one like I taught the hoes how to be hoes in Atlanta, but like on some real ho shit. <laughs> And then my second one is gonna be nigga, cause like I actually don't like that word, but I use it all the time. All right, so ho, what's the definition of how we use this today in today's society? How do we use the word? Okay, so funny enough, the fact that I use the two words ho and nigga, cause let's do this. I got ho. Oh, I like that song. a young nigga phone. Like that's literally both of the words. But anyway, okay, so when it comes to the word ho. A lot of people use it like the word bitch. Like we um like bitch had to be like friendly. But like when we first started, ho was um what's the word? Derogatory? Derogatory. Derogatory. See, that's wow. right. No, that's that's all good. It was derogatory mm -hmm. and it, it was it was more on the fact it was like, okay, she got ooh, everybody in her phone. She like she's like she hoeing for money, she hoeing for clout. She's like, first off, I'm a hoe nobody that's somebody. So I wasn't hoeing for that, but I was like, I had to own the word ho. Like, you know how Amber Rose hoes, like, it was, it was cute for, ho to own, for her to own it. But when I owned the word ho, I was like, I was a hoe in middle school. I mean, in high school. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so it looks like the real definition of the word ho is you uh, um, a long handled gardening tool with a thin metal blade used mainly for weeding and breaking up soil. That's funny because like I don't break up happy homes but I'm long as thin. But when it comes to hoeing, to be completely honest, I feel like as a female that just means you are you know your sexuality. Like, like as a female, we, like when it comes to sexuality, we don't it's it's fucking a cliche. Like it's really it's really baffling that females are okay with being sexual. They're okay with being open with the fact that like I like to get things down. Hell, I like pussy too, but like it's like we don't say that shit out loud. And to be a hoe is because it's multiple people. Niggas do it all the time, but when I say niggas, I mean the male species. Like 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 it's it's weird. So how does the word hoe make you feel at this point, knowing what you know now? At this point in my life, if you call me a hoe, that just means you know who I am. Because it's funny because like if I'm a hoe, like I'm Nikki River. My name is Myers Carlethia, but the only hoes that know me are Nikki River. If you don't know Nikki River, you don't know the hoe in me. And then like I'm only a hoe to people that are special. Like it's like it's a it's an energy thing. Like it's honestly so one you of the, feel comfortable like, using it. I have to be comfortable yeah. hoeing out for you. So it's like, it's like that word, like it used to hurt people's feelings. It never hurt, but like you have to be strong in your your hoeism if you want to if you want to do it like that. But like honestly, to be a hoe is to be proud in your sexuality. It's to be proud in your feminism. So it's not it's not necessarily having sex with multiple people. No, it's just being proud. It's being in your proud in the fact that because like you have you have hoes who are only hoes because they don't wear bras. You have and, and the, here's the thing about that. I'm a hoe who's a teacher. My kids love me. Let's talk about that. I'm a hoe who decides, who decides that, okay, you know what? This is my main person, but like when life gets rough, I can call so-and-so and he's like, oh yeah, I'm with it. Or she'll be like, well, I'm with it. Like, to be a hoe is to be sexually liberated. Like, Cause like you, were, like, like you, you got people who have to slut walk. Cause I feel like it's a, it's a, it's a synonym, ho, slut, bitch, all that shit means the same thing. Cause like I'll call a best friend a hoe and not even mean it on no sexual shit. It's like, what's up, ho? What's up, bitch? Damn, you a whole slut out here. But it's like on some funny shit. Like, and it's like, like I said, I chose two words, ho and nigga, because I feel like they coincide. Maybe I'm wrong, but maybe I'm, I'm definitely right. All right. <laughs> so we will be back with nigga and Maya's Carlita.